choke. He's got it. It's under the neck. There it is. Nope, it's on the chin. There's the towel. Okay, picture this. A company famous for smartphones and smart home gadgets suddenly jumps into the super competitive electric car game. And not just jumps in, but makes a massive splash, giving the big players like Tesla some serious jitters. Sounds like a movie plot, right? But it's real, and it's the story of Xiaomi. You probably know Xiaomi for awesome, affordable tech like smartphones. While Apple famously hit the brakes on its car project after spending billions, Xiaomi, sometimes called the Apple of China, slammed the accelerator. They jumped into the EV game in March 2021 with a hefty $1.4 billion, and boy, did it pay off. Their first car, the SU7 sedan, caused an absolute frenzy. Imagine 50,000 orders in just 27 minutes. This isn't some side hustle. Xiaomi's aiming to go global by 2027, making established players like Tesla look over their shoulders. Is the EV world about to get a major shakeup? Xiaomi's explosive entry wasn't just luck, it was smart planning. They set up their car factory in a key Beijing tech zone, tapping into ready-made supply chains. When the SU7 sedan launched in March 2024, the response was phenomenal. Nearly 89,000 pre-orders in the first day, forcing a massive production ramp up. A killer move was pricing the standard SU7 around $30,000 in China, undercutting Tesla's Model 3 and instantly grabbing attention. The delivery stats are just as wild. 100,000 cars built ahead of schedule by November 2024, then hitting 200,000 deliveries in just 119 days from the start. Delivering over 20,000 cars a month for five straight months proves they can keep up the pace. So how are they building so many, so fast? Their Beijing factory is a monster, running double shifts since June 2024 to meet the insane demand for the SU7, easily blowing past its initial annual target of 150,000 units. And they're not done. A second factory phase is nearly complete, gearing up for their next big launch, the YU7 SUV, showing they can scale production at a speed rivaling even Tesla's early days. Current estimates suggest they're churning out around 900 cars daily, potentially hitting 330,000 a year. It's not just about quantity. They're using clever manufacturing tech, like an efficient battery design with Kai ATL and making their own critical parts like motors. This in-house approach, much like Tesla's, gives them more control over quality and innovation. Xiaomi comes from the world of consumer electronics and software, and they're bringing all that know-how to their cars. This is where things get really interesting. Take the SU7 Ultra model. This thing is a powerhouse. It boasts three electric motors kicking out a mind-boggling 1,548 horsepower. It can go from zero to 100 kilometers per hour, that's zero to about 62 miles per hour, in just 1.98 seconds. 1.98 seconds. They're calling it the fastest four-door production car on the planet. That's a direct challenge to high-performance cars from brands like Tesla. What do you reckon? Could your daily drive use that kind of acceleration? Battery tech is another area where Xiaomi is flexing its muscles. The Ultra version uses Kia TL's Kuailin 2.0 NMC battery cells. These operate on a 900 volt system, which means super fast charging. We're talking about going from 10% to 80% charged in just 11 minutes. If you can find a charger that powerful, up to 490 kilowatts. That's faster than Tesla's current superchargers. Imagine less waiting and more driving. And then there's autonomous driving. Xiaomi's HAD, highly autonomous driving system, is no slouch. The SU7 Ultra comes packed with sensors, three LiDARs, 5mm wave radars, and 12 cameras. That's a whole lot of eyes and ears for the car. This multi-sensor approach is a bit different from Tesla's more camera-focused system, and some believe it could be better in tricky city driving conditions, especially in busy Chinese cities. The excitement for Xiaomi's cars isn't fading, it's red hot. They've got a massive order backlog, nearing 300,000 cars. People are actually waiting up to 49 weeks to get their hands on one. This demand is huge, especially with so many EV brands out there. A big reason? Smart pricing. The SU7 Ultra, for example, ended up way cheaper than first hinted. This aggressive strategy aims to steal market share, putting pressure on Tesla. For now, Xiaomi is laser-focused on winning in China. 
They've already delivered over 180,000 cars there by February 2025. Their plan is to dominate at home, then take on the world. Xiaomi isn't just happy ruling the roost in China, they're packing their bags for a world tour. The big plan is to hit international markets by 2027. Their company president, William Liu, spilled the beans that they even started checking out potential spots in Europe back in March 2025. This is like throwing down a gauntlet right in front of Tesla, especially since Tesla is also beefing up its European operations. Get ready for a proper global showdown, but they're not just rushing in. Xiaomi's playing it smart, taking a page from the books of other successful giants, maybe even Tesla's early days. The strategy is to build a super strong base in China first, then use that success and cash to fund their big international adventure. Plus, here's a neat trick. Xiaomi already sells tons of phones and gadgets in Europe, so folks there already know the name. That existing brand recognition could be a massive shortcut when they start selling cars. So what's Tesla doing while Xiaomi makes all this noise? Well, they're definitely feeling the heat. We've seen Tesla slash prices on its cars in China, a sure sign they're trying to keep up with sharp priced newcomers like Xiaomi. Of course, Tesla still has some aces up its sleeve. That huge supercharger network and its long developed full self-driving tech are big deals. But here's the kicker. Xiaomi is catching up and fast with its own cool tech and charging solutions. China's competitive EV market with players like NIO and BYD facing headwinds presents an opportunity for Xiaomi beyond just challenging Tesla. While Tesla's global production offers flexibility, Xiaomi's China-centric model carries risks. Riding high on confidence, Xiaomi aims for 350,000 deliveries by 2025, potentially entering the global EV elite. The anticipated May 2025 launch of their YU7 SUV could further boost sales and profitability, solidifying their market position. One of Xiaomi's coolest secret weapons might just be its universe of gadgets. Think about it. They make phones, smartwatches, smart home stuff. A whole ecosystem. Imagine your Xiaomi car talking seamlessly to all your other Xiaomi devices. This kind of connected experience where your car is just another smart part of your life is something traditional car companies, even Tesla, might find tricky to copy. It's a fresh take on what a car can be, and it could really set them apart. So is Xiaomi really a nightmare for Tesla? Let's be honest, Xiaomi bursting onto the EV scene is a game changer. Shipping over 200,000 cars in the blink of an eye, keeping those monthly sales figures sky high, and drawing up bold plans for global domination? It all points to one thing. Xiaomi is a genuine, serious threat to Tesla, especially on Tesla's crucial Chinese turf. The heat is definitely on. Tesla counters with global factories, a vast supercharger network, and advanced self-driving tech. Xiaomi's aggressive pricing and in-house innovation compelled Tesla to defend its leadership. The EV race just got a whole lot more electrifying. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel.